Morning guys, a bit early, I know, but I wanted to share this with you. These are kind of dragon fruity things. Or potatoes and stuff. And uh, they only really bloom at night. So luckily I was up early this morning still doing my stuff in rubbers and stuff. So I'm gonna, fortunately some of them are up pretty high. Look, I spotted a bee helping me with some fertilizing, but it can be hard. So there was a bee in here, some insects. There he is, just a second. There he is. He's helping out. Trying to trying to make sure that they're all kind of pollinated in that. It's a bit hard since they're up high. I don't know if you can see me that well. But yeah, hopefully it'll take. Just getting a few of them. I've only got a few. I think there might be um I think it might be yellow dragon fruit. I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell just from the just from the uh, the plant itself at the moment. Probably won't know until it properly fruits and all. Uh, it's clambering up in the middle of the street. Fertilizing. Oh there he is again. Thank you, mate. Because usually you have to fertilize these by hand because there's not always a lot of insects around. You're doing a bang up job. I don't know what kind of bee he is. Maybe someone who's a bit more into bees will let me know. He used to be having fun. Hopefully he'll tell all his friends about it. I just had a little bit in here just to be sure. The bee actually passed really close to, uh, to my hand and I could feel the breeze coming off of his uh, his wings. It's not that easy with one hand. <laughs> I'm filming. Um, hopefully there's some fruit. They look like it might be a yellow one. Just a second. See up there? Uh, it might be a fruit coming. But it could have bought. Um, it's not fertilized properly. They'll do that and then they'll abort themselves and stuff. I don't think there's one more that I can get. There's a few more that haven't opened yet. There's one more I can get. I'll have to do that without the camera though. They are really kind of cool though. Wait a minute. Here I go again. Fertilizing. Fertilizing. Come on, you can do it matey. See from here, this distance, I can actually feel the wind off of his wings, but beating furiously. <laughs> it's wonderful stuff. I've been wanting to see these guys flower for a very long time. And a lot of times I forget, but for some reason this this season, this year, um, there are a lot of them flowering for some reason so I hope things will go really well it's a bit precarious um, and I get some good flowerings and stuff oh, I think I'm gonna have to leave that one probably a bit dangerous to try and get at but yeah hopefully I'll, I'll get some dragon fruit um, 
Hopefully it won't be taken by people in the neighbourhood. Because this, this is out on the street and all. But, uh, yeah, it's it's a weird thing because dragon fruit, I think um, they'll set that down. So you droop down like that. Encourages them to flower. Because then the plant goes, oh my god, I've got to propagate. And there's that bee again. Hey matey. Oh, there you go. So yeah, um, yellow dragon fruit. <laughs> Gardening in latex in my neighbourhood. Oh my god. Anyway, I'm going to pack up this ladder. Uh, have a cup of tea. I'll keep an eye on this because it looks like some of them might um, flower again. But probably tonight. They're looking like it. <laughs> They've got a good view right there. I'm peeing up my nose. But yeah, they flower usually at night. So it's really good that I actually got up early enough to, to, to see them. And hopefully help them along. <laughs> okay. I'll catch you guys later. Have a good Friday and a good weekend too. Hey, you Pete.